The harm principle holds that the actions of individuals should only be limited to prevent harm to other individuals. John Stuart Mill articulated this principle on liberty, where he argued that the only purpose for which power can be rightfully exercised over any member of a civilised community against his will is to prevent harm. The rational part of the teen's brain is not fully developed until around the age of 25. Recent research has found that adult and teen brains work differently. Adults think with the prefrontal cortex, the brain's rational part. This is the part of the brain that responds to situations with good judgment and awareness of long-term consequences. Teens process information with the amygdala. This is the emotional part. In teens' brains, the connections between the emotional part of the brain and the decision-making centre are still developing and not necessarily at the same rate. Liberty consists in the freedom to do everything which injures no one else. Hence, the exercise of natural rights of each man has no limits except those which assure to other members of the society the enjoyment of the same rights. These limits can only be determined by law. Brain imaging studies suggest that antisocial and violent behaviour is associated with structural and functional deficits in the prefrontal cortex. There is no heterogeneity in findings and it is unclear whether the findings apply to psychopaths, non-violent offenders, community-based samples and studies employing psychiatric controls. A meta-analysis was conducted on four structural and functional imaging studies and the results show significantly reduced prefrontal structure and function in antisocial individuals. Effect sizes were significant for both structural and functional studies. With minor exceptions, no statistically significant moderating effects of sample characteristics and methodological variables were observed. Crime. Legal definition. An act or omission that violates the law and is punishable by a sentence of incarceration. See also felony, misdemeanor, offence and violation. Anticipatory crime. The hallmarks of narcissistic personality disorder are grandiosity, a lack of empathy for other people and a need for admiration. People with this condition are frequently described as arrogant, self-centred, manipulative and demanding. They may also concentrate on grandiose fantasies, their own success, beauty or brilliance, and may be convinced that they deserve special treatment. These characteristics typically begin in early adulthood and must be consistently evident in multiple contexts, such as work, and in relationships. People with narcissistic personality disorder believe they are superior or special and often try to associate with other people they also believe to be unique or gifted in some way. This association enhances their self-esteem which is typically quite fragile underneath the surface. Living Will a document prepared by an individual in which they state what they want in regard to medical treatment and euthanasia. Religious ethics are the moral principles that guide religions and that set the standard for what is and isn't acceptable behaviour. Surprisingly similar from one religion to the next, these fundamental principles flow from the core beliefs and ancient wisdom of religion as well as its teachers and traditions. Active euthanasia. In active euthanasia, a person directly and deliberately causes the patient's death. Assisted suicide. This is when the person who wants to die needs help to kill themselves, asks for it, and receives it. Dignity. The value that a human being has simply by existing, not because of any property or action of an individual. Indirect euthanasia. This means providing treatment, usually to reduce pain, that has the foreseeable side effect of causing the patient to die sooner. Nihilism. Noun. 
the rejection of all religious and moral principles in the belief that life is meaningless. See also negativity, cynicism, pessimism, philosophy, the belief that nothing in the world has a real existence, historical, the doctrine of an extreme Russian revolutionary party, 1900s, which found nothing to approve of in the established social order. Origin, Latin, nail, nothing. English, ism.